everybody. We're back. Uh, folks, for the last six years, my next guest has starred on the show Boy Meets World on ABC. Please welcome Mr. Ben Savage. <laughs> You know, you, you actually have a really cool name. I was just thinking. Thank you very much. Ben Savage. Yeah. yeah. How you doing? I'm good. Good. Yeah, good. thanks for being here. Thank you guys for having me. Yeah, have you, uh, I, I can't believe that I'm looking at the, at the card, which tells me everything to say. Okay. And it says your show's been on six years, which is as long as, you know. You our, guys have been on, we started at the same time. We've been on about the same time, yeah. Right. So your fans now that started watching the show when they were kids, how old are they now? The fans that we grew up with, you know, we started the show when I was about 12. Right. So I was like this young little kid, and our, our fans were basically like younger people. Mm -hmm. But as I've grown up, like our audience has grown up, so most of our fans now are like in college. So I get guys coming up to me all the time, just like fraternity guys, like, yeah, we love your show, like I grew up with it. And like they play drinking games to our show, they do everything to our show. <laughs> So don't don't, really let, that, don't let that go to your head, because they play I, drinking games about everything. Oh, okay. yeah. it's not, no, it's like, you're talking about people that, like, we watch the evening news, and every time they say Kosovo, we go That's for it. My, my, gr my, you my girlfriend on the show, her character's named Topanga, and mm -hmm. that's a pretty eccentric name. Right. So, uh, I guess they like that. So, um... They just like hearing the name Topanga. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, they told me, some, some guy came up to me, he's like, yeah, I go to, like, Penn State, and every time we watch your show and we hear the name Topanga, one of us has to take a shot. So, I guess, but I guess it's just an excuse to drink. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it sounded cool to me. I was pretty excited by it. Yeah, people like, tell... yeah, you play drinking games to my show. Yeah. Now, yeah. I, I meet kids all the time, they're like, we watch your show, and every time you go to commercial... <laughs> <laughs> that that, that works with any show. Oh. It's not right. Well, that's so, right. It's still cool. So the season is wrapped right now. Yes. You got some finished. free time on your hands. Yes, I do. And I've been uh, very bored. So I've sort of taken to uh, doing activities that I wouldn't normally do. It's a little, a little strange. Like what, like what kind of stuff? Like, uh, for example, I've been able to feed my obsessive habit for... Uh, I'm really into 80s music, like 80s cheesy love songs. Do you like those at all? Like I... No, I don't. Oh. <laughs> um, I love like uh -huh. Foreigner. What are you talking about? Like uh Foreigner, Toto, Crowded House, all those guys, all those groups. Well, you know, that's they... like, that's, well, to you, you're 18 years old. Right. That's that good old time music. Yeah. The, that, to, me, that always... rep to me, that represents a hellish time in my life. Oh. <laughs> See, I'm always listening to the radio today, and I'm like, why can't it be like it was in the 80s? That's when times were good. Yeah. Yeah. When everyone looked like the bass player in Flock of Seagulls. and Yeah. I have no idea who that is. <laughs> I'm sorry. Andy, even you don't know what I'm talking about, do you? No, I know I'm Flock of Seagulls. <laughs> Andy knows. Andy's 21. Uh, so, uh, so what other kind of stuff do you do besides listening to this music? I mean, uh, I've been, I've been sort of, you know, I live in Los Angeles, so mm -hmm. I've sort of been taking LA for what it's worth. Um, I've been, uh, you know, I like to do the cheesy things in LA. I don't mm -hmm. know if anyone else does, but like, mm -hmm. I always act like. I like Are you looking for a date? That's what. <laughs> I, I'm I don't not. Know, I like to go fly fishing. Anybody else like that? <laughs> Who wants to come? But, uh, no, I like to do, like, I like to go to Hollywood Boulevard and, uh, not to do that. I just like to go, like, look at the little stars. Like, I like to go to the wax museum. Wax museums, yeah. Uh, but, uh, there's this, there's this one place that no one, none of my friends will go with me. And, uh, I, it sounds like so much fun to me. It's called Tinseltown. Mm -hmm. And it's in Los Angeles. And basically what it is is you pay, like, $100. And you go to this like fake mock award ceremony, and you get out of your car, and you're like flanked by like reporters and people asking for autographs. And wait, listen to this. A hundred bucks, really? Yeah. Then you, so you get out of your car, and people are like, you know, we want your autograph. And then you walk down a red carpet. I'm interested in this? Then yeah, there's an award ceremony, uh -huh. okay? And you like win an award plus free dinner. That's great. So you're just treated like a big celebrity. Yeah. And I, I'm telling you, everyone, it's like Ben, what are you doing? But I just, I, I, I think it sounds like fun. Well, don't you get treated like that anyway? I mean, you have a yeah, TV show and this, stuff. You get to pay a hundred dollars. It's fun. <laughs> okay. I want to do this. You've clearly lost your mind. Yes. Love. Uh, well, but, uh, hey, if anyone wants to come, just call me. <laughs> I, uh, yeah. You know, I like 
life through the... There, you know, everyone loves award shows. Yeah. yeah. They're so exciting. They're so much fun. Yeah. It's actually, you're paying the $100 for the walk down the carpet. I mean, that's really... Uh, I yeah. would do that. I would pay 100 bucks to you walk down what? a carpet. Get yourself a red carpet and walk on yeah. it whenever you want. <laughs> yeah. I'll just have you take the pictures, yeah, you know, yeah, ask for sure, autographs. Sure. But they actually have actors there going like, yeah, shouting like out your name. Like, See, ben, Ben. You know? I want to do that. <laughs> yeah. that. You want to go? I would go with Doesn't you. I would like that experience. No one in L.A. wants to go. They're like, oh, that's for Whenever I go to Rio... Uh, awards uh, ceremonies, photographers are always yelling at me, you're blocking Jason Priestley! Yeah. <laughs> Get you, Priestley! <laughs> well, Boy Meets World is uh, Fridays. My, my show always ends now with a threat. Yeah, it's seriously. Jason Priestley. <laughs> Boy Meets World is Fridays at 8.30 on ABC. Uh, really good having you on the hey, show, thank Ben. You for Thanks for being me. here. Say thank hi you. to your brother. Good man. Ben Savage. Take a break, folks. We'll be right back. Today.